Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. And hopefully you guys are all ready, hopefully for a pretty good day when it comes to the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X restocks. We should have quite a bit of news and a little bit more updates, too, as well, for quite a few of the little vaca uh, locations we're watching for, looking for, and all of that. We're actually going to maybe probably go do, like, our normal, like, you know, day-to-day -day update, but we actually might go give you guys maybe a nice another midday update, too, as well. So maybe be on the lookout, because we actually are seeing a lot of stock. And, of course, if you guys are a part of any of these drops, Please send me a tweet, send me like an email, send me a picture, or all that stuff, because I love we get to see people getting their consoles. So it should be, I think, overall kind of good day with a little bit of new stuff as well floating around. So you got to give a nice little thumbs up for that. And as well, like I said, we have a few little updates too we'll kind of be giving on up throughout the day. So I appreciate you guys all so much for watching, for clicking on the video, and as well, hopefully you guys will get your consoles all throughout today in these next few days. As well, if any of you guys are brand new, make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on, as well, for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. We have the Amazon links down below for the invitation sign up. <laughs> we actually did go and see a little bit of news for that. We have the Twitter and Twitch stream down below if you guys want to follow up in either or. The Weebles and the Coinbases and Targets and all that good stuff too as well. So let's go and talk about it. So the very first and foremost thing I do want to go talk about what we brought up as of yesterday, which is on the PlayStation Jurette emails. So uh, we actually did not go and see any more official updates for when it came to this. Uh, I tried my best to ask around, someone who got the initial, like, email itself, still never had a follow-up with it, so watch that throughout today and throughout the rest of today. So in case you guys are kind of curious on what we mean, so basically they had an email that sent out more of your chance to buy a PlayStation 5 console, and basically heads up with your name, details of your opportunity to buy a PlayStation 5 TM console, direct from the PlayStation are coming your way very soon. Make sure to add email.playstation.com to your contacts so you don't miss out on the next email for the date and time of this exciting invitation-only event. So, uh, as you guys can read through that email, we do have an ongoing PlayStation 5 direct drop that should be happening sometime throughout this week. Although, uh, as I mentioned, we didn't really seem to have too many updates from yesterday. So, this was uh, from yesterday and the day, and then as of like the day itself, we just didn't see more timestamps of like, hey... On, like, January 25th, you know, at 3 p.m., we'll have a chance to get a console or any of the other various things. So I just want to let you guys know, throughout today, you guys probably want to be checking your email. So either, number one, check it, like, right now just to go and see if you have the uh, initial invite. And also check your emails for the Amazon stuff. We'll talk about that in a second. Uh, but basically check to see if you have this initial invite itself first and foremost. And then as you guys have the email with it, then just be on the lookout throughout today to still see if they'll give you like a proper dedicated time or dedicated allocation for it. Just so you guys can get maybe hopefully get your uh, PlayStation Direct drops. There is also that chance too they may have even like sent one out throughout the morning and might have a proper PS Direct drop throughout today. So uh, keep that in mind. We are watching that pretty closely. We're going to keep on seeing if there's any more stock movement with it. And we can kind of go from there. Now the part two of this though. As I mentioned for Amazon, and make sure you guys are using the link down below and sign up for the invitation, we did go and see more invitations last night finally make their way on out there. So it might be number one. <coughs> First and foremost, good for you guys to maybe check and see if you guys did get any Amazon PlayStation 5 email invites. If you guys did, that should hopefully mean a lot of you guys can get your consoles. And as well, you guys can check the Amazon link with it and check the Amazon online stuff, and hopefully you guys can get your consoles. Although, maybe since it is, like, depending on when you guys watch it, it may be already sold out and out. But we have been still kind of seeing more Amazon restacks every, like, three to five days or so, give or take. So I just want to let you guys know, I have been watching that. I have been seeing that. Keep on being on the lookout for it. So you guys can hopefully go get your consoles in stock with it. So, are on pretty good thumbs up with that. So, I like, I like seeing that stuff. I like seeing people get their consoles and drops. All around good stuff with that. Now, some other little updates, and this is something I'll probably want to maybe give another separate update on throughout the day if we see more news, is that it does seem like we've been seeing a lot more of stores actually having stock available for the Best Buy drops themselves. So, uh, first and foremost, we actually had more of an update for this drop itself. So I want to let you guys know it's probably worth it to check, number one, the Best Buy app glitch. I know you guys are probably getting annoyed by hearing that nonstop, but make sure you guys go and download the Best Buy app. Find the SKU units for the PlayStation 5 bundles, both Horizon Disk, Digital, and Disk, and as well the normal consoles, and also Xbox, if you guys care about that. But we actually have seen the website now update too, where we actually are now seeing even more. This is like just in case you guys ever think we're capping, or you guys think we're lying about stuff, or whatever. Uh, basically, as you guys can see now with many various locations, we are now starting to see more locations having PlayStation 5 bundles. So a good example for this one, look over this, where you have the 2001 W. Worley St. Columbia MO, 
uh, 95 miles away, apparently, from wherever we're looking at. And they do actually have the PlayStation 5 Horizon bundles available in their stores. Or if you guys look at, say, like this 4100 University Avenue, West Des Moines in Iowa, I think that is, or I have really no idea. And it's 99 miles away, and they would have the PlayStation 5 bundles available. So we now have some more updates with it where we can actually now go and see people slowly getting their stock. You guys also look literally right there. Uh, you guys can even see, like we saw, like a restocked over at 8372 uh, Grand Ave in Chino, California. And like we're seeing some stuff even for Xboxes, uh, GPUs, and all of that as well. So the main reason why we're talking about this is the fact that we are still seeing loads of Best Buy store locations getting and receiving PlayStation 5 bundles for the Horizon bundles. So I want you guys to go and keep on checking. We saw even a lot of people coming up in my Twitch chat. We saw people coming up on Twitter. We were seeing YouTube comments and tweets and everything else out there of people finally getting and receiving their stock. So it's looking pretty good. Like we actually have been seeing a pretty good W and like a lot more folks than we'd be anticipating getting their Best Buy stock. So it's kind of on the point where uh, we're kind of in like more of the middle of the drop, I'd say. But sometimes just being in the middle is usually kind of nice. Because it does kind of incentivize you to be like, okay, we've been seeing a lot of successes. We've been seeing a lot of stores getting stock. We've seen a lot of Best Buys getting stock. So it's like more incentivized for you to go check your stock yourself. If the Best Buy app glitch in the SKU has the store as either unavailable or sold out, as you guys go and check the stock with it, it basically kind of gives you the good rundown where you can hopefully get your consoles and stock with it. So big thumbs up. Please keep on checking your Best Buy stores. This has been one of the best places and best timings right now for people getting their stock. To the point where I might even give like another separate part two day update if we're seeing a lot of folks as of today. It's kind of like a little extra shove, an extra push for some folks to be like, oh, whoa, well, I should probably check my Best Buy stores. So like I said, you just check the app. If it shows up in any locations or anything else at all, please go and check and see or give them a phone call when the store is open. We usually do see a lot more store stock updating around right before store opens and right after stores close or like right before stores close, you know, whenever employees are kind of going through the internal stock. So please be on the lookout for that one and keep on trying to get your stock with it. But all around, good stuff. We like seeing the stock looking pretty good. Now, it's all the same thing too with Target. We do always have the Target links down below. Keep on checking and seeing it for your local Good Morning stock. We've been seeing a lot more successes on the Best Buy side. Haven't been seeing as much more for the Target side. But they are still showing on up there. We've been seeing some people get in their areas and complaining about stock and complaining about how they have a chance to get their stock and all that. So keep on checking and seeing if you get any good movement. I want you guys to get your stock ASAP, so I'll keep trying on and out. Kind of the same time as those we mentioned, but right before store open, right before store close. But I think this week has been way more allocated towards the Best Buy side rather than anything else. So keep on checking both, but Best that Best Buy definitely has a lot more. Uh, like like I, I can literally like see the Best Buy stock literally on the right side of my monitor right now. Like I think that's like probably the nicest thing for us to be like, okay, we should probably you know be checking for stock or looking for stock. Uh, GameStop. Don't forget, we haven't really seen any updates so far. We'll be watching to see if they do include anything as of all throughout this Wednesday on this upcoming Pro Member Rewards. Maybe th Thursday we'll see some stuff, or maybe on Friday. We haven't seen the official confirmation if they'll be doing anything special for the drop or not. Uh, like we haven't seen any Instagram posts, tweets, or whatever. So we'll kind of keep you guys in the loop if we see more stock with it. Walmart. We still have been not seeing too many more updates on the stock. We didn't make a video complaining about it yesterday, and I still think it's kind of somewhat unacceptable seeing all that where they're just not getting any stock. So if you guys are part of that issue still, uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know if your things process or slowly actually move on and go from there because I just want you guys to get your consoles in stock. Like, it's lame that you guys aren't getting it. Uh, although we can maybe see if they might do a drop on Thursday. I kind of doubt it, though, because they are overdue for a lot of stock. Uh, but keep that in mind. Sometimes we've seen Wednesday updates for Walmarts on Thursdays. So, good stuff with that. Now, overall, for everything else, too, we haven't really been seeing too many more updates. Uh, Costco, still could be watching for them for a PlayStation 5 in the morning for their bundles and new drops. Ant Online did go and do their bundles, as we mentioned, so we'll kind of cross that off for the list. We'll still be watching to see if Sam's Club will do any of their Horizon bundles or not. Hopefully they will. Fingers crossed they will. Uh, just for any updates with it. And then same thing, too, as well for the new egg for the day-to-day -day shuffles. Once again, key on the lookout in case there is a public and open PlayStation Direct on the day. We have been seeing Microsoft Directs also doing their normal drops, and still been seeing a few more of them popping up on both Best Buy and Targets for their local Xbox stock as well. And also, guys, don't forget about, too, the overdue, like, Dells and Dorma bundles, Verizons, Kohl's, etc., etc. We haven't been seeing too many walk-ins, too, as well, still. We'll probably be watching more for the weekend. Same thing for the Krogers, Fred Meyer, Smiths, and all of them. We still haven't really been seeing too much with them, but they are on the very overdue for online and also in stores. So we'll wait and see if there's any, like, mid-tier stuff that happens, but at least Best Buy, go and check. 
And so make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. We have the Amazon links down below as well. Make sure you guys are signed on up and check your email. Same with the PS Direct, Twitter, and Twitch stream down below if you guys want to follow. And sign up for that Weeble, Target, Coinbase, all the other various links down below. And I appreciate you guys all so much for watching.